Hello there and welcome back to Let's Play Etrian Odyssey. I am the RN Genius, but you may call me Eric and in the last episode we explored a fair bit of the... Um, we're still on the second floor of the Yggdrasil Labyrinth. We encountered a couple of those... Um, the foe type enemies. They were patrolling the areas and we just saved. We just sold a bunch of stuff. We got... I think we sold stuff. Yeah, we probably sold stuff, right? Let's look at our items. Uh, yeah, we sold stuff. We got new tweed jackets. That is good. Um, this time we're gonna go into the forest and because I just saved, I want to see what a death looks like. And there is one, um, one foe, one enemy that, um, stands in place that I cannot get around. And I will walk right on through. See, it, I, I, I don't know what I expect to happen. I'm gonna die. There is no ifs and buts about it. I'm going to die in that encounter. But we'll try our best, won't we? I am curious as to what those foe type enemies are about. The game told us be well prepared with, if you want to encounter one of those caliber. Uh, I'm not well prepared. I'm gonna come out and say that right now. I'm not well prepared for that, but um, we're gonna do our best and it's not gonna be enough. And we got a hard shell. I like hard shells. Um, we're also gonna use a skill of Eric to heal our buckle back up. Um, Chuckles' um, TP, her, her uh, t tech points, increased greatly in the last episode because we went t um, to uh, level 5 of TP increasement and that earned us another 20% up and now she's at 44 to total. The enemy I'm speaking of is if you see, if you look at this, my mouse cursor, oh, I can point at things again, but I should not, I should not be too comfortable with that. You might not be able to see my mouse cursor. So in the top left here, there is this one passage that I could not get to the end to and there was a foe sitting right there and he aggroed when I got close. He turned red and followed us for a bit. He of course, not, not for particularly long, but he followed us all right. And um, I'm curious as to what he is guarding and why he, he does the things he does. We'll find out here. Uh, bugs I can deal with. You can attack that one, you can attack that one. I probably should have left the blue one alive. Nah, it doesn't matter. Doesn't matter. We'll use another vault in this battle, though. Another vault. Another vault. Oh no, Eric. Not, not Eric. No, 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 no. Don't do it. You don't want to do this. You guys don't want to do this. No, you don't. You don't, though. You didn't want to. <sighs> Alright, they wanted to. Insect Eye and a level up for Eric. So, I, I'll need to heal up again. And then... That is good. That is fine. And now we'll level up Eric. What do I get? What do I get? I am curious. Um, HP up? No need. TP up would be good, healer up would probably be best. What else is there? We could pick up cure 2, no necess not necessary. Restores a small amount of HP to the entire party. Healer, healer above level 3 and cure above level 3. And for self 2, cure 2 above level 3. And for self 3... There is no self 3. How much does that cost? The self? 6 TP. Mm. Small amount of HP. I mean, this is nice, but... I wonder, I wonder. I do. Regen would be nice. CPR... Immunize resistance to all and elements on the party. Healer and salve above level three. Kikukius is the one that I cannot get my hands on. Heals up to a certain amount of it. total HP outside of battle. Healer above level ten. Yeah, that is good. 
That is not absolutely passive though, that is... Hmm, I wonder. Scavenge would be nice to pick up though, so I'll level up TP and after that I'll go into healer again. Good. Now that that's cleared, we can go kill ourselves. We'll probably get to run away, but what, what will that do? I might as well let myself get slaughtered there. I mean, running away after that, you cannot heal up if a party is already, you know, gotten crushed. Doesn't matter too, too much. What else, what are you gonna do except for, you know, uh, letting yourself get killed and go in there again? Oh, three toxic bugs. No, no, no need, man. I don't want to, I don't want to. I really don't. I have gotten tough encounters here. Like no no bunnies at all, and of course your poison hits. Why wouldn't it? Why would it not? Jesus! Are you trying to make me mad? You are it's working! Gosh! It is not nice. That really is not nice. Stop it. The worst is, oh, my throat actually hurts, and a critical hit, he deserves it. My throat hurts, and um, at least I didn't die, and um, I, I, I've only recorded seven episodes, that's not much. We get a level up for our buckle, and for Keenan. okay, let's heal up again. Bloop and bloop. Level up Arbuckle, you'll get Aegis. Yeah, passive skill. Passive sounds awesome. Chance of automatically blocking enemy attack. That is That requires a lot. What else would I like? Smite. Eh. Cure. Stalker would also be... Nah, TP too. I mean, he doesn't use much t many TP. I don't think this stalker is that good. I want to level up anyway, so why would I want to not get into encounters at that point? You, I could level up damage or whips, but you are not, it's not working with you if you get attacked all the time. Cuffs Ecstasy to totally bound enemies. What is a totally bound enemy? Like, is a totally bound enemy someone who's got his head entangled, his legs entangled, and his arms entangled? Incredible damage to totally bound enemies. Hmm. Climax, whip skill that may kill and drain enemies with low HP. Effect HP 5%. Hypnos. Sword, 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 and take. I don't care about the sword skills, I care about my damage. I care about my health. I care about my defense, but he does not have defense up. I'll I'll get the health up. The first health up is pretty good. With a, the 10% increase, it's pretty good. So I'll get that. And now we're gonna, you know run into a death trap. Actually, do I had, had I healed up? Yeah, I did heal up. Oh god. That's not the right way. That is definitely not the right way. This is a another three toxic bug fight. You can, you know, do things to me that I don't want to... I almost said it too. That's the worst. Um, I fin recently finished my um, Let's Play of Risen 2, which I should have started uploading by now, at the, at the point you can see this video, and um, that, that, that game has a lot of um, vulgar language inside of it, so I'm very... I, I've kind of gotten used to using swear words during that Let's Play, and now it's kind of tough not to use them. Now, don't you defend! What are you doing, you cl little, little wuss, you craven? Not necessary. Not necessary at all. Like in this situation, a self would be worth. We'll see. When I get that self, it's probably gonna suck, isn't it? There 
is an enemy back here. He's right in front of me now. And there's a passage to go to the left. He's on to me, all right. He's right behind me, right behind me, right behind me, right behind me. Why, you bugs, why? Don't need to. You don't. Uh, leave the wood fly alive? Question mark? I wonder what if a viper can murder a poisonous fly. We'll try. Oh man, we'll go the risky route. We'll do it like this. This might wipe them out, but probably not. That was, that, those were some good misses. Five damage plus the viper. Will they take the fly out? No, of course not. Well, we'll level up some more and after that, it will. It will be good enough. I do have quite a lot of TP, even with my, even with my front liners, which is good. I'd like to see those 27 um, MP, uh, uh, um, TP on Arbuckle. Do like those, you can parry that shit. Yeah, hey. Hey there. Um, I'll, I, I will heal up. Yourself? No, you're doing fine, Arbuckle. How, for how long does he follow me? Still following, still following, still following. D aggroed. He's moving away. Oh, he's aggroed. Huh. Let's see. Kuyuthu. Kuyutha. Kuyutha. Okay. Hi. Uh, you friendly? He does not look friendly. He looks real angry. He looks so angry. Yeah, he's probably gonna be faster than me, Arbuckle, so preparing might not wor end up working out for you. Let's do a little staff attack and a vault. Viper, that thing is slow. Vault formula. Rampage. Ooh, I did not manage to uh, defend from that, huh? Huh. Well, that's gonna be a one shot against Keenan. Let's use another Viper here. The parry did not work out for you. Was he charging that thing up? I'm gonna parry again. Maybe that was just, uh, you know, luck. Maybe. Cuth attacks, misses! That thing looks scary. 31 damage with a Volt is not much. It's not much. I'll parry again, that Rampage looked like a special attack. And as far as I know, if they attack normally... ...and not attack Keenan, ...they will get parried. Uh-oh, that's a Rampage coming. <gasps> Ooh, I parried that shit. This is going good. This is going good, except for Arbuckle's health. That's not good. Uh, how do you do that? How did you get through Arbuckle's defense there? I've done 50 damage every round, and that guy is still standing. Like, he is standing strong. Oh, oh, that hurt. That's not good. That is not good. Is that thing dead? Yeah, he's all, he, he's alive. He does only, quote unquote only, do 50 damage per round, so he should not have more than 300 health, right? Oh god, that was Chuckles. That is not good. Uh, yeah. Ah, that's a wipeout. Eric is also dead. The adventurers have fallen. That thing was angry. That was angry. Save your map data. Uh, I did not get any map data. I did not get any. What's the drawback here? What's the drawback to dying? Do I lose money? I probably do. Uh, um. 
I reload my cartridge. So I don't lose money. This is pretty much a hard reset. Oh, I lost money. Nope. Previously I had 900 something. I swear to God. I swear to God. Previously I had 900 something. Um, my party members, I did not save my levels. No, I most assuredly did not. Uh, where am I? How am I going to record this? Uh, sure. I'm going to go back in. Why not? We wanted to test that out, we did test it out, and now um, we know what that thing is like. We know that we do not want to encounter that asshole again. So we're not gonna. Let's go inside again and uh, not encounter the Arbuckle. No, that's Arbuckle's me. That thing was called uh, Kuyutha. And um, Kuyutha turned out to be a beast. Three moles. At least the monsters are randomly generated. Or the encounters are random, I should say. Not the monsters are randomly generated. That's just wrong. They do not do much damage anymore. Which is appreciated. Now I of course have to redo my level ups and those fights against the the the, the, the poison moths. Soft hide. Oh well, that thing was strong. That would have been a nice reward getting at that, but um, I wonder if all of these are that enemy. I think not. I think not, because that guy behaved. Um, uh, he he behaved differently from the other enemies I encountered here. The others were just patrolling their normal thing, and that guy was just sitting there until he smells my 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 I don't know my uh, adventurous stench. That is a thing, right? He's almost done. He is now done. Enemy has fallen indeed. Eric levels up. I will use a heal and then give me my TP up back. Uh, TP up, yes. Alright, and let's go to the location where we left off. Nope, you're not. You're not getting me. The lo oh! Don't do it. Don't walk the wrong way. You're gonna get into a very bad fight. Eh, uh, that's not good. I haven't seen you in a while, further. Well, they're not gonna one-shot me anymore, but still, that is no good. You're gonna eat a vault. Really, I did 20 damage to that ass. God damn it. Ah, Keenan. I can't explore anymore. Oh, damn, damn. I can't, I can't even, like, cut the part out where I walk back because there's so many encounters and then you don't see me fighting those battles. That's the worst about random encounters. You cannot just cut a part out. I can't just um, tell you, oh, I went back on foot and I got this encounter, that encounter, that encounter, and I level up this, 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 and this. No, I can't. I cannot cut anything out. Oh, it's the worst. Why do you die, Keenan? Always gets one shot. Darn idiot. All right. All right. That's gonna be how that goes. Level up our other people and then you get one shot again because you don't level up with me. That is no good. Uh, at least our buckle gets stronger. Maybe at, at some point I can put Keen in the back row and just have him be chilling there until he levels up to good. Until he levels up to a good point. Don't need to use anything against these guys. Eh. 
He even gave him the good armor. That's the worst. That's the worst part about it. I gave him the good armor. And I miss his damage. I'm gonna use a warp wire to warp back now. Just because. That is that is how dumb I think this situation is. I don't want the same character dying all over and over and over. That is just the worst. Okay, let's use an item. Let's use another warp wire. I have 750 gold left. Yeah, let's use that. Don't don't dwell on it, please, game. It's already bad. Don't put salt in that open wound. Okay, Shilekas goods, we are going to buy another two warp wires, because those are good. And then we are going to buy accessory, and we're gonna buy Ocarina is for the... Uh, we're gonna buy the Hide Ring. Because that apparently works for Arbuckle, maybe it'll work for Keenan as well. So Keenan, I hope you're gonna be happy with this. I hope you are, because if you're not, I'm going to give it to you. I'm going to give it to you, not a good way. Let us revive Keenan. Yes, everybody has TP. No need to heal, no need to sleep in the inn. Okay, we'll heal up. And just because I did shenanigans in this episode, I'm going to go back in and not end it right now. So this episode will be like 30 minutes long. Just because I did shenanigans. I, 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 I know I wasted the first 15 minutes trying to go against that thing. We knew we were going to die and I, I did that anyways. But um, now I'm going to have to now I'm gonna have to live with that decision. I was hoping I might, might be able to, you know, vault it to death, but nope. That didn't work out. Well, we got a couple of vaults in. A little bit of damage there. You attack that guy, you attack the wood fly, and you guys attack that tree rat. And don't you give me that not able to one-shot the tree rat thing again. Yeah, you better. You better. Maybe with a boosted attack, I might have gotten into that um, Kuyutha's thing. I was probably close to killing it, right? That seems feasible, considering they didn't do that much damage. Okay, that damage was significant. If I hadn't blocked that attack twice, I would have been dead all... Like, I did an extra 100 damage because I he attacked me and I parried that shit twice. But the parrying did not work out that well. Like, I don't know how he broke through my parries. I don't know how he managed managed to par get past my parry. And now I will not be using... Like, I, I will not um, commit to the too good to use syndrome anymore. These guys reduce my health and thus they deserve vaults. And every time I use a vault, one enemy dies. Man, that's gonna have to be healed. He didn't die from a vault? Are you mad? Sir! Don't do this to me! Not a, not th this late in the evening, you don't! Keenan, you better level up a couple of times here. Before you die again. You better. You better. I can't do much more with your health at this point. We're gonna have to level his health up. I can get it to at least level 5 or something, although level 5 is a stretch. That is a hell of a stretch. But what else can I do with him? I really don't know. We have to level up his health. Moles and a venom fly. Yep, I'll uh, focus fire on the moles and then we vault that venom fly to oblivion. Don't you poison me. Don't you poison me. Okay. Whoa, you attack Chuckles. Chuckles almost never gets attacked. That is also a reason why I almost never have to heal her, and I will continue living by that um, thought. I will not heal Chuckles. Sorry, girl. 
Gonna have to live with that damage. Nice level up there. That is going to be health. And now let us see. Uh, this guy. He's three steps away. One step away, but that definitely is a dead end back there. He moves two in that direction. He moves to the very end of that section, so I can't actually... I cannot um, check out that dead end back there without getting, well, murdered by that thing. And who knows what that, what enemy is, that is. Even if it is a just, quote unquote, just a Kuyuthu, I, I, it's gonna, <laughs> it's gonna be bad either way. Don't you dare. You're trying, but someone's tell, telling you not to. Don't have to use poison anymore, you don't. I can't believe I didn't manage to poison the Kyuthu either. Kyuthu, I'm sorry. I mean, I hit it with a Venom Strike so often, like three times almost, until I get one shot. Okay. Nice. Enemy has fallen. That is good experience from those three toxin flies. Okay. You go back and forth between those positions. Actually, that is absolutely fine. That's a dead end. Oh. That makes the situation a little different. So you go there, there in front of me. Right, right. And then you turn around, come back there. Yeah, I cannot reach that dead, that dead end either. So let us make that clear on the map. I'll put that there, that, make it so. And uh, memo event. Can I just do one? No. Event, put that there and call it invest. Why do I have so many letters to be given here and not? Well, okay, this is not many. This is re really just a very short note. Uh, check. Wall. Enter. So if I push that, check wall, it says. Good. Good. That is very nice. Um, because that is probably something, as is the other situation back there with the other... Um... Wait a second. Can I not... If I map out this area, will I see that enemy anymore? Will I see him? This is one space. This is where I sat. And at that point, he was directly in front of me, before he was here. So this is the final tile. And this is two spaces. We'll also put an event here. No, 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 you don't. And put a memo on it. Saying exactly the same. Check wall. Check that wall. Enter. Alrighty. And now, question is, will I see that, will I see that pink enemy? Go all the way down. Oh, I am so glad I didn't walk into that bubble. I am so glad I didn't encounter that strong enemy there. Oh, ho, 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 I thought I did. I really thought I just encountered it. Ooh, I thought I made a boo-boo. Good. That is very nice. Um, we will attack these venom flies. Or will I attack the... No, I'll attack the wood fly. I cannot take out a venom fly myself. Oh, I thought I made a boo-boo. That would have... That would have been horrible. Don't do it, man. Why Keenan? Why Keenan? You didn't have to. 
You really didn't. <sighs> it's always going to be the same, isn't it? Always, at all days, at all times. Good experience, though. And we are going to heal you up yet again. I'm running out. Of, I only have two more heal usages. Good lord. Alright, we'll continue around this way. They all disappear. Okay, if I have not um, set foot on the tile but drew it myself, they are not visible. Which is not good. Uh, what? No, 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 no. That is floor two, huh? How, how do I get back up and in the, into the lower section back there? Ugh. Okay. They're gonna make they're gonna make sh some shenanigans happen here. Stairs down. It says down at least. Okay, let's look at this full map though. What am I still missing? I'm only missing these sections. I could have probably traversed into the bottom area where the first um, foe is that I encountered. No, I he, I cannot pass by him though. I can only pass by the 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 second one. The third one also ends up murdering me if I investigate that wall. All right, let's go down. Marble Orchard of Soldiers. As you descend to a new floor, a premonition of bloodshed surges a chill down your spine. Even new adventurers such as yourself can clearly feel the overwhelming sensation. It is the specter of death looming over you as you pre prepare to face unknown dangers. Take heed, beasts red of tooth and claw run rampant here. Fleeing from these creatures is no shameful thing. In these depths, survival's paramount. There's a dude. Ah, ah, he is onto me right now. He's red. Yep. Now he's not red anymore. He's red. Jesus. What do you do in your free time, man? F just stop following people. All right. Red again. Nothing in these corner. Oh, there's another one. That's an interesting floor layout. Oh, God. Don't do it. Don't have to. You don't. This guy's not to be mess like not to be trifled with. Oh, where are you going? Oh no, that's not where I wanted you to go. Uh, what are you? Mandrake, of course. How could I not notice? Do not tell me that that thing is the resistance against Vault. Corrode. Defense decrease on everybody? Uh, don't put that guy in one condition, like in one fight with a moose. Do not. Oh, of course he's resistant against Walt. He would be. No! Oh! Oh! He doesn't do much damage. Should have used Venom Strike. Enemy have fallen. Let's see how much experience that guy gives. Not much. Hardwood, hey! Mandrake. Hi. Uh, why are you do go in this direction? I just want to get past this thing. I just want to get past it. Disengage. Come on, asshole. Just disengage. There you go. No! Oh, no, 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 no! Uh, stalker, hi! Uh, let us escape with everybody. Do not rip. Oh. You did not have to put me here, man. Uh, 
I just want to get past this thing. Wait, I got past. No, I didn't. I didn't. Right behind me. Right behind me he is. Is this the second one? There is only this one. Or is there? I don't want to run into a second one here. Oh, well, we got past him. But the encounter is going to happen soon. Oh, that thing is so much of a problem. Hello, door. I passed through the door and the door closed behind me. That is very nice. Um, we're gonna put a door symbol here. I don't know how I'm gonna map that place out yet. Not if I encounter mandrakes and such. And um, since we got past that, uh, what's this corridor? Okay, since we got past that door, um, I will end it here. It's been 35 minutes. Good Lord, what am I doing with my life? I hope you enjoyed it, and I hope I will see you in the next episode as well. Thank you very much for watching, and I'll see you then. Bye-bye.